Good morning, folks. We've got just a couple things to hit today. We're going to look at paleomagnetic intensity over the last 40,000 years, the urban heat island effect, and of course, we are starting with the last 24 hours on our star. Very quiet last day on the sun, and here at Earth geomagnetically as well. The solar flaring, eruptive activity, and the solar wind are all relatively calm at the moment, but we do have reason to have eyes open. We're watching the incoming plasma filament on the south you see here, the thin, dark, snake-like rope of plasma, and we are watching the sunspots, but the ones of greatest focus are beginning to shift. As of yesterday, the southern incoming group, bottom left, was the top watch, but we can see now its magnetic complexity is not so drastic. Meanwhile, the other groups have continued to morph as they cross center longitudes, and they are currently containing several points of magnetic complexity that can make solar flares, none more so than where we'll be zooming in here to find a longer distended region where positive and negative umbra are close together and interacting. As always, we're monitoring for flares and other eruptions. First up in the articles today is something Dr. Roy Spencer and Tony Heller would like to see. New paper shows the urban heat island impact at Tehran, and it's far worse than many have suggested. With a difference of 5 degrees Celsius between the Tehran city temperature readings and the rural areas around it, that is more than double of all the purported global warming. One of the key methods of how they paint their picture of the global atmosphere, more and more urban temperature gauges. Lastly here, folks, a new sediment core shows some of the key geomagnetic variations over the last 40,000 years. It's important to note that no single stack contains every known excursion, but when it shows several, you've got a good confirmation of the pattern. Mono Lake is in here, as well as the event 6,000 years ago and the modern drop of the field into the excursion we're having now. Seeing more scientists jump into the field the last couple of years and consequently, more of these confirmations. We greatly appreciate your support. We'll do this all again tomorrow, right here, but right now at 6 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.